In this video, we will review how to track changes and resolve differences. There is no track changes button in PowerPoint as there is in Word, so you sort of have to do this manually. You can make a copy of the presentation and send it to the reviewer, and then they can put in comments and make changes, and then when you receive it back, you can use the compare feature as we did in the merging multiple presentations video. To modify options for tracking changes, you click the File tab, click Options, and then enter your name so that people will know where the comments originated. Then we'll take a look, when we compare the file, we'll take a look at discarding changes from specific users and then managing comments. Here is the original presentation. And here it was sent to Jane Doe and John Smith for review. And you can see that both of them, well Jane changed the color scheme here and she commented about it. Uh, he just commented, he didn't make any revisions to this slide. And if you were also reviewing the presentation, you could click on review and then new comment, and then you could make a comment. And then if you decided that you no longer wanted your comment to be there, then you could click delete. Notice when you click on these, wherever people made changes or made comments, you get a little annotation here. And if the comments pane is not already visible, you can display it by clicking on the little comment annotation. So now, this is the reviewed presentation. We're going to go back to the original version and compare it and decide which changes to accept. To do that, you click the Review tab, click Compare, find the reviewed presentation, and then open it. And you can see that it did merge the presentations. But notice that we don't have the brown color scheme. You have to go through and accept the changes um, for that to occur. So we are on the first revision, which changed the color scheme. You can click the drop down arrow and click accept change. And then let's move to the next comment or next change. Someone inserted a slide so we can accept that change. Notice that we can accept all changes to this slide or we can just accept them one at a time. So you can continue progressing through the presentation that has been reviewed and you either accept or reject changes. And when you're finished, you can end the review. and then I recommend saving it with a different name. And this concludes the review for tracking changes and resolving differences.